hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice math algebra problem and here we have a minus 4 and its whole power 4 equals to a to the power 4 so here our target is to find the value of a so uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we move this a to the power 4 in the left hand side and it will be written as a minus 4 and its whole power 4 minus a to the power of 4 and this whole equation equals to 0. And uh, now in the next step we uh, rewrite this equation as a minus 4 and its whole square and its whole square minus we have a to the power of 4 and it will be written as a square and its whole square and this whole equation equals to 0. And now in the next step we use here the nice algebraic identity and you know about this identity if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b. So here we use this algebraic identity uh, on the above term so that our above term will be written as in this form so we have this is the value of a and this is the value of b so we have a minus b and we write it as a minus 4 square minus b is a square into a plus b so our a is a minus 4 square plus a square and this whole equation equals to 0 and now in the next step uh, we can just again use this uh, algebraic identity on this term and uh, this term will be written as uh, a square minus b square so here we take this all term as a and this is b so we again use this formula and we write it as a minus 4 plus a into a minus 4 minus a and here we open this uh, square identity and when we open this square identity it will be written as a square plus b square minus 2 times of a into b and plus a square and this whole equation equals to 0. So uh, in the next step we uh, just simplify the terms and here we obtain a plus a becomes 2a minus 4 and here we cancelled these terms and we obtain minus 4 and here we obtain a square and plus 4 square is 16 minus 2 times 4 is 8a plus uh, this is a square and this whole equation equals to 0. So now here we have uh, two cases uh, so our first case is we write this equation equals to 0 and it will be written as minus 4 times of 2a minus 4 equal to 0 and the second case is we write this whole expression equals to 0. So here first we add a square plus a square it will become 2 times of a square and we have minus 8a and plus 16 equals to 0. So uh, now uh, we find the value uh, of a from this case. So in this case we move this minus 4 to the right hand side or we divide both of the sides by minus 4. And you see that this minus 4 is cancelled out by this minus 4 and we obtain 2a minus 4 equals to 0. And uh, uh, now in the next step we move this minus 4 to the right hand side and it will become 2a equals to 4 and here we divide both of the sides by 2 and you see that this 2 is cancelled by this 2 and this 2 times of 2 is 4 and we get uh, a equals to 2. And now in the next step we move towards this quadratic equation because in the first case we get the value of a and now we can simplify the second case and in second case first we divide each expression by 
two uh, so in this way and here you see that this two is cancelled by this two and we obtain a square minus this two four za eight and it is minus four times of a and plus two eight za sixteen and zero over two becomes zero so uh, in the next step we can uh, easily make the factors of this equation or in other words we will use the quadratic formula so now here we use the quadratic formula so in order to use the quadratic formula here we need the exponents of this equation so the exponents of this equation are a equals to 1 b equals to minus 4 and c equals to 8 and our quadratic formula will be looks like in this form a equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a and now we can substitute the values of a b and c in this quadratic formula so the value of b is minus 4 and it will be written as minus times of minus 4 plus minus square root of b square so our b is minus 4 square minus 4 times of a into c divided by 2 times of a and our a is 1 and now in the next step we will simplify all these terms and we write it as a equals to 4 because this is minus times of minus becomes plus 4 and plus minus square root of minus 4 square is 16 and a 4 times of 8 is 32 divided by 2 times of 1 is 2 and now here we simplify uh, this equation and we have a equals to 4 plus minus 16 minus 32 becomes minus 16 square root divided by 2 and here you see that we have 4 plus minus uh, so here you see that uh, the negative sign becomes inside the square root so it will be equals to iota and we know that the square root of 16 is 4 times of iota divided by 2 and we have a equals to so we separate these two terms and we get 2 plus minus 2 times of iota so these are the other two complex roots of the given equation and it's one real root r a equals to 2 so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos